Cool, let's go. My favorite photo or project of all time. That's really difficult because I'd always say my last one, which was actually a really cool shoot we did for a property. And we created photos we never have created before. Lots of portrait dreamy shots. And it was just so magical that I fell in love when I started editing it. only one single lens for the rest of my life. Probably have to be my 16 to 35 mil um, 2.8 GM lens just because it's so versatile for everything I do from landscapes to my hotel content creation to even portraits. It's a very good all-rounder. So the biggest obstacle I would say in getting new clients is that there's a lot of competition in the travel and lifestyle kind of niche. And you always have to be on top of your game. So we have to come up with new ideas, new creative um, types of photos and videos all the time, which I love because you're just at the end of the day building new skills. Our best marketing move of all time was actually not only shooting Mike and I as a couple and have a couple's account, but also having our individual Instagram accounts, which meant that we could do things as a couple and kind of have that romantic feel, but also do our own things, which just doubled our work. increased my confidence while speaking on camera. In 2007, I actually started vlogging and back then I was really awkward and I kind of had to build my confidence by getting great feedback on my videos and just trying again and again and again. And that is why I am at where I'm at the moment. What really motivated me was people either just giving me good solid feedback saying just pretend no one's there it looks like you're very awkward on screen and that kind of reminded me I was the only one kind of in front of the camera filming myself and all my worries just kind of went away. <laughs> I definitely think there is room for newcomers in the industry. Really, there's always a chance if you're really creative to get into the industry if it's really your passion. What was heavier, talent or hard work? I think a little bit of both is the perfect mix because even if you have the most raw talent in the world, you still need to put hard work into whatever you're doing to put really great content out there. Okay, so knowing what I know right now in my life, um, the advice I would give to my younger self is to definitely just stick to things and not be embarrassed or ashamed of anything, especially things I'm putting online or images I'm giving to clients. I used to kind of be scared. It's almost like imposter syndrome where I felt like I was never good enough and I really had to overcome that just by constantly shooting and getting good feedback to eventually be so confident that I now love my own work.